good friend. You were at the gates just now, no? When the goblins came, you saw them up close? A few questions, if you please. There's no overstating my interest. I'll make it very quick. Hand to heart. Glory. Now then, how would you describe that particular batch of goblins? Size, nature, distinguishing qualities? You search your mind, successfully recalling various details of goblin behavior. Goblins were of a rare jam-colored hue and wielded magic blowguns. A mythweaver. This man has no respect for truth. And the dragon they had marching in the rear, was it of the brass or silver variety? Witnesses failed to notice the obvious dragon. Last question, then you'll be quite free. Did the attackers rally to the absolute when they fell upon the gates? They did, didn't they? Oh, oh, curious. Oh, curious indeed. I've interrogated one. A captive in this very camp. She reports they've abandoned their god, Maglaviet, in favor of someone called the Absolute. The scandal! Ah, but is superstition all? These goblins are informed by a kind of strategy anathema to their kind. I, for one, intend to get to the bottom of it. I'm just preparing to head to their camp as we speak, in fact. If you'll excuse me, I ought not to dawdle. Never you mind. Who needs mercy when you have a quick tongue? And an invisibility potion stashed in one's back pocket. Until we meet again.